Welcome back to Goldfish for You. I'm just giving these guys a clean out. The water change. I'll clean the tubs out. Turn the air off so you can get a proper look at them. You see we've got some really nice goldfish in here. These are all going to go into the new pond when I finished it. The weather's been so bad I've not been able to do much with it. But I'll show you that in a second. It's just a quick, quick video really to show what I've been up to. Let's show the fish off. So you've got some really nice goldfish. Anyway, so the pond. This is where I'm at. It's all covered up because obviously in the UK we've had really bad weather and I don't want to get wet. So what I'll do, that's the old liner that came out. This is the old liner that came out, the, the, old, the old pond. Still waiting for the new liner to arrive. I should be here tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow being Thursday. I'm putting this video out on a Wednesday. So what I'll do is I'll just remove all this and I'll go right back to you. Okay, I'm back. I've taken the cover off. I'm going to tell you it was only to protect it from the weather that we've had. I don't really want to get in wet. So we've got two sides up, one there, one there, and an end. Now they're all boarded inside and out with 100 mil of insulation in the middle. The floor's got 25 mil of insulation in it. Um, this polystyrene stuff, if I can get the box open. There we go. So that's in the floor. Some left over, so we use it up. And then how we secured this together, as you can see, that's not going anywhere. How we secured this together is using 100 mil, oops, camera focuses, 100 mil weather resistant screws with a washer on, just so it can't be pulled out. Now when you screw these in, because we're going through the beam, through the joint, going through the joint, sorry, um, it pulls the whole thing together. So as you can see here, there's a post that runs down there, and then a post that runs down there, and that straight through that post into that post and pulls the whole thing, whole frame together. So it's got three in that side, three down that side, and three across the bottom, making it really secure. It's not going anywhere. I've got to do some trimming up on these boards, but that's not a major deal. Um, it's dead, dead straight here dead straight here dead level and it's dead straight between the two sides when you put a beam across it but for some odd reason this back is out even though it's flush there and it's slightly high there <coughs> excuse me slightly high there but it's low in this corner so i'm going to have to put a little packer across the top here but once the line is on and the tops are on you're not going to see that at all just don't want it running out that corner um, ignore the mismatch um, boards, just trying to use up what I've got instead of having to go out and buy some more. Price of wood is so expensive, I don't want to spend any more on this than I have to. The liner was already £156. I should be here tomorrow, so I'm told. So hopefully, if the weather's good at the weekend, which they do forecast it's going to be, I can get that. This end here built, insulated, and then liner it, underlaying a liner in. And that's all ready to rock and roll. The sides are all going to be clad, as I said on previous videos, so you won't see this at all. We're just going to use the feather edge that we've already got, and then just clad the front, that bit of the front anyway. I'm going to put detailing down here so it all matches up, and then we're going to clad this again on the outside with the same feather edge. I said it was just a quick video to show you what I've been up to. Hopefully, um, we'll get this finished on Sunday, if the weather's not too bad. Um, if we don't, then we don't. It's one of those things that I have to wait another week. I think these guys would probably like to be moved out of their tubs to a bigger home. Because that's where they're going, is into this new pond, which I think they'd be quite happy with. The filter for it is over there on the main pond, which I showed in the previous video. Um, and I think that's about it. If you like this content, please think about subscribing. It helps the channel out a lot. Hit the bell notification button so you get notified whenever I upload a new video. And if you did like the video, think about hitting thumbs up. 
you got any comments, suggestions, anything to say at all, drop them in the comment section below and I'll get back to you. Um, for now, I'm out, I think, and I'll see you on the next one. Cheers, bye.